Wow. Contact. Finish. Yeah. Always kind of with this one. Since my setup is backwards, again, when I kind of go through this with players, I think it looks a bit awkward. But if you ever look at like Harry Kane's setup, Coutinho setup, different outside of the box than it is the inside of the box. But the Rashford one, remember against Trent? That's a good example of it. When he chops it, I think it does go a little bit square, but since Trent's body shape is going this way, it just means the ball's out in front and he's gone straight into his contact before Trent can even get close to making contact on it. That's when he's using his momentum against him. Yeah, what a finish. And a penalty. Nice, great area. The studs, I actually like it when you're standing, like when you can stand someone up, but when you're running at real pace, which is what we are probably gonna be doing, I would rather that one, okay? Not my personal preference, I think it's gonna be so much easier to do that and keep your momentum going this way than when you're running, running at full pace to try go studs, it's very difficult to turn your hips. Well, if I go here, naturally my foot hits the ground straight away, and now I'm into my next touch. Yes, brilliant, brilliant. Yes, get around it, bang. Yes, Tyler. Difficult one, really difficult. Oof, touch. Bang, bang. Get in, yeah. Finish. Adjust. Wow, what an adjustment, Tyler. Dig it, brilliant adjustment. Oh, you deserve that one. That's enough, bang, bang, adjust to it. Yeah, ooh. Adjust. Yeah, nice. Hit. Oh. Yeah, that's the one. Go. Not bad. Contact. What a finish. Good adjustment. Hit. Like the contact itself is actually quite good. It's just the setup has to be so good. It has to be so precise to get it right. Yeah. Now you're, you've adjusted to it quite well a couple of times where your hips have been quite pretty much facing the opposite direction and you have done very well to wrap around it right but again it all kind of comes from that final touch you take before you set it up yeah so a couple of times you've got a little bit too direct towards target because then from there it's so difficult to go from here and then to there while if I go outside my left shoulder and here now obviously the ball ends up on the inside of my shoulder when I take my touch and when I turn but there means I can go really chop it there and then bang into my contact yeah that's exactly the one we're looking at okay yeah that's it bang that's it though you're going to start with the football at your feet and you're going to go touch just into the, into your frame like you're going to go hit it bang bang set it up contact yeah brilliant yeah oh shoulder over the ball yes excellent Great setup. Yeah, brilliant. Find a way it's a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. Set up. Hit. Yes, good finish. Yeah, it's static. Yeah, it's difficult doing it static, especially that type of one. You kind of need the momentum. Yeah, and I, yeah, overthink a little bit, but you kind of need that momentum to get into it. But I just wanted you to almost like feel the touches, feel the setup. Okay, because your areas are actually quite good. Now that we've taken the hindrance out of it and added a little bit more momentum to it, it's flowing really nicely. Beautiful, get that. Yeah, areas. Yeah. Yes, good. We're still at the early stages of this, by the way. Still technique, you, you gotta build it up, but looks good. Yeah, off we go. That's it. There you go. That's exactly it. Yeah, brilliant, brilliant.